All right, I'm here with Logan Stever to my left and Hunter Stever to my right. Going to talk about all the success they've had and uh, where they came from. First off, guys, how's it going? Good, good. Good. You? Hunter, good? Yeah. <laughs> all right, uh, what are you guys doing this weekend? Uh, what, what's going on? Um, we're at a wrestling camp in Milan with the Burnettes and you and some Kent State coaches and Michigan coaches. Okay. Uh, Hunter, how far do you guys live from here? Um, we live exactly 11 minutes from here. 11 minutes? Okay. All right. Uh, where's Chris this weekend, Phillips? Phillips. He was at regional track meet, and he failed to qualify in his event, but he's an alternate in another event for our team. So okay. He's in track mode right now. Track mode? Okay. But he's is he going to, like, shift over to the... Uh, yeah, he's going to Fargo. Sure, so. Okay, Fargo 171? Yeah. All right, uh, tell me about, Logan, this one's for you. Right. Tell me about uh, 20 and unders. You won the 20 and unders at 121 and a half? Yes. Okay, uh, walk to the tournament real quick and who you wrestled. Uh, First off, you're a sophomore in high school going to be a junior. Yes. And you are how old? Uh, 17. 17, okay. Talk about winning the 20 and unders. Uh, it was fun, it was hard. A lot different, a lot more hand fighting and stuff. And uh, my first match was Tyler Clark from Iowa State. He was uh, NCAA qualifier this year. He was ranked somewhere in the top 20 this year. And uh, I beat him 3 nothing in the first period. Then he beat me 2-1. to one, And then I beat him 5 nothing in the second period. Uh, my second match was against a kid from northern Iowa. Uh, I didn't know who it was. I tacked him 7-0, 7-0 both periods. Third match was uh, David Thorne from Minnesota. He's a junior in high school. Uh, he beat me the first period five to two, and uh, I beat him the second and third period one nothing, one nothing. My fourth match was Tony Ramos from Illinois. I beat him three to one, two nothing. And then my finals was against Zach Sanders from Minnesota, and uh, I beat him. One nothing, one nothing. Okay, so that puts you in the, you were waiting for the winner of the mini tournament, uh, but you didn't go to that. Yes. Why didn't you go? Uh, well, I played football in the uh, fall, and I wasn't going to be able to go, so I decided just not to even go to the trials. So not to take someone's spot if you're going to be playing football. Right, right. Yeah. Okay. All right, uh, Hunter, yes. talk about Fila Cadets. You had kind of a rough tournament for you. Yeah. Okay, and what motivated you? Then you went and you won the Central Regional. What motivated you? You went 5-2 and two at Fila Cadets. What motivated you? You beat two real good guys at that Central Regional. What was the motivation? Would it have been that 5-2 and two finish? Or, and, you know, what would you do? What would you change to, you know, beat real, two real good opponents at the Central Regional? Um, I st changed my hand fighting. I started hand fighting more. I, every time I was in a close match, I just thought of that and that I didn't want to lose anymore, so it's helped me get through the matches. Drill partner. Drill, drill partner? Drill partner is Logan <laughs> helping me get there. And coach helped me there. Okay. All right. Uh, what about the match against Deutsch? What was going through your mind when he was across? He had you like UFC'd. <laughs> what was going through your mind he had you? Why didn't you go? I really don't remember the last 45 <laughs> seconds of the match. It's hard to think when you're passed out. Yeah, I was kind of like... like Gasping for air, but I watched it and I don't know how. <laughs> <laughs> you can't explain it. I just kind of like laid there. You, you kind of just didn't go, huh? Yeah. Would that have been a rough ride home if you'd have gone? Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Talk about. I don't care who feels this one. Uh, talk about your dad. Who? Your dad. Oh, my dad. Well, it's kind of crazy sometimes, but he's pushed us, and him and my mom—they both took us everywhere and paid for everything and. I'm glad they have. Sometimes, sometimes it's a little crazy, but that's how every wrestling family is. A little, a little crazy? A little crazy. Okay. Hunter, talk about uh, Eric's dad, Ron Burnett. Uh, he, was, he was awesome. He taught us everything when we were younger. And everything we do now mostly is based around that. And it's like, thanks to him, he got us into it, got us wrestling harder and smarter and where we are now. Okay. So you'd say Ron Burnett, you guys definitely would 
put him, your dad and Ron Burnett and now Eric, you know, kind of taking it as more advanced. So, Ron Burnett was the beginning though, huh? Yes, he yeah. started us out when we were young. Okay. A lot of Jolly Ranchers? A lot of Jolly Ranchers after all your practice. We had a good one, you can get two Jolly Ranchers. Oh, I bet you love the two Jolly Rancher practice, didn't you? Oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> all right, uh, who wins at, between you two, who wins at, let's say, NCAA football? That's the only football? Yeah. Oh, you guys. I kill them every time. I'll say yeah, you're right. <laughs> oh, I just throw it deep every time. You throw it deep? You can't cover. Yeah, it's, right. it's pretty bad. All right. Uh, who wins between either of you two and Phillips? Phillips. He's an Xbox guy, so he always he just plays like Halo and shooting games. He's a shooter? Yeah. Shooting games? Yeah. He can't stop the run. He can't stop the run? No, especially with Vince Young <laughs> and NCAA O something. Oh, something. Okay. What about uh, Tassari? Is he a gamer at all? He's kind of a party or whatever. <laughs> whatever. A Mountain Dew guy? Mountain Dew. Yeah. He's a fat. <laughs> <laughs> He's a fat? <laughs> He's a fatter? Okay. Uh, Logan, why Ohio State? Uh, well, uh, I mean, I love Ohio State. I've always loved them. And uh, this, I looked at it and everything, and they just have everything I want. So they have good coaches, good people surrounding them. So I want to be a Buckeye. Two hours from home? Yeah, real close to home. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Uh, Hunter, what are you going to do to defend your cadet title? Uh, keep working hard and going back soon and working on everything I need to work on. Uh, not such a cliche answer. What else are you going to do to defend your title? Um, <laughs> Get a good diet. Get a good diet. Okay, that was the safe answer, oh, I guess. Diet. Like a Clarky diet. Yeah. You're gonna eat like uh, spinach and green chicken. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Anything else that you guys can think of? I, tell me one fact that someone may not know about either of you. Uh, Logan first. Um, one fact no one knows about me. I can do a backflip when I'm down to about 122, 123. You can do a backflip when you're down to weight? Yeah, so can not, I, now, though. That's not, not now though. Not now? Why not now? Because I got a belly right now. <laughs> okay. All right, uh, go ahead, uh, Hunter. Give me one fact. Um, Are you in the choir? No. <laughs> do you play football? Yes, I do. You? I don't really? start. I'm you like behind Logan and everything. Three spots. Three spots. Behind Three spots. Okay. Yeah. All right, guys. Uh, we're looking forward to seeing you guys in Fargo, Burnett's Olympic Training Center. You're going to be everywhere this summer, right? Yep. All right. Keep training hard, and thanks for your time. All right. Thank you. Thank you.